Hello, and welcome to Halloween. It's Halloween here, as you can tell by the lights. <laughs> I have mixed feelings about Halloween. On one hand, it has chocolate, candy. Those are not the same thing, so you have to split them up into two separate categories. It has the best colors, the best scents, but on the other hand, it's scary as fuck. <laughs> so to celebrate Halloween here on this channel, I wanted to do something special for you, all of you. I am going to put out one movie commentary a week this month. That's right. I'm actually going to do it. Hey, it's editing me. So this video is actually already late, <laughs> which I think we all knew was going to happen. But you're still going to get four Halloween videos. It'll just be, you'll just get two in one week. <laughs> okay, bye. I already have determined three of the movies that I'm gonna watch for sure, but I thought what would be fun for the fourth movie is to allow you all to decide a scary movie for me to watch. <laughs> if you have been here on this channel, you would know that I am a, I believe the words I used was a little bitch, in that my spooky tolerance is only it's ankle high. So, I mean, what would be more fun than letting you guys determine a scary movie for me to watch and just watch me s scream around? So here's how it's gonna work. I am going to like leave a pinned comment down below and you can just put whatever scary movie you want me to watch. And for the next two videos as well, the movie with the most votes, I'll watch it. Quick rundown of like the scary movies I've already seen. The Ring, Amityville Horror, and E.T. So vote for whatever you want, you know, whatever you think would be most fun. Subscribe. You're gonna want to come back. You're not gonna want to miss that fucking show. But to kick off our little Halloween adventure here, we're gonna watch something that's just easy peasy, nice and breezy, or whatever the fucking saying is, I don't know. But we're gonna watch Hocus Pocus. I'm in my best witch colors, I've got my witch vibe going, and I am ready to watch this. It's a classic. You know what Hocus Pocus is. If you don't, you will now. There will be spoilers though. So, off we go. I wish I was a witch. Witches are real. That's my belief. <laughs> you know that if you've been here. I like wish I was one, but I know I don't have what it takes. You know what I mean? Like, I'm not cut out for that lifestyle, but I feel genuine comfort knowing that they are out there. Emily? Emily? Don't like the music. Oh, God. The woods! <laughs> Does this whole movie take place in, like, this? Why am I forgetting? I don't remember this part of the movie. <laughs> Come, child. Children nowadays, I feel like, are better equipped for this. You know, they know not to like go into strange houses with witches. <laughs> this is a kids' movie. It is kind of scary. <laughs> You idiot. My little book. We must continue with our spell now that our little guest of honor has arrived. She needs to be more scared. Is she not terrified? I'd be terrified. Crying, even just a little bit of crying, would make this witch movie a lot more realistic. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Pay attention, guys. <gasps> They've seen him twice now. You can't convince me they didn't see him twice. One drop of this, and her life will be mine. I mean, ours. Yeah. She's got ulterior motives here, I think. Open up your mouth. No! <gasps> A boy! <laughs> <laughs> me? I think that would ruin the spell. I don't think you can burp in a spell. Whatever shall we do with him? Let's barbecue and filet. Hang him on a hook and let me play with him. No! Ew. Come to mommy. Yes. 
His punishment must be more foolsome. The book sounds like the thing off Adam's family. <laughs> Give him fur black as black, just like this. No! Witches, daughters of darkness, open this door. Hide the child. There be no witches here, sir. I mean, you look kind of guilty. I will ask thee one final time. Yes? What hast thou done with my son, Thack? Is this a kid's movie? Well, I don't know. Holy fuck. Cat's got my tongue. They're just gonna execute them. Sisters? See. No, they're not. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> we shall be back, and the lives of all the children shall be mine. <laughs> remember that happening that just happened and so the sanderson sisters were hanged by the salem town folk holy crap granted that uh you guys here in salem are all into these uh black cats and witches and stuff stuff, stuff. i wonder if people who live in salem just like hate this stuff like just they're like do not talk to me about witches it's the one night of the year where the spirits of the dead can return to Earth. That's why I don't like Halloween. No, thank you. You don't like it here? Oh, the leaves are great, but just all this Halloween stuff. You don't believe in it? Like they don't have Halloween in California? Do you say Halloween or Halloween? Either way, you don't have Halloween in California? I think you do. I think you just don't have leaves, but you definitely have Halloween. You don't have leaves. <laughs> you have leaves in California. Yeah. Do they change color? I don't know. I'm from Canada, so I have no idea what happens there. Paul! Who are you? Max. <laughs> Jay and Silent Bob. I'm Jay. This is Ernie. How many times I gotta tell you? My name ain't Ernie no more. My name is Silent Bob. Gee. We don't get any smokes from you. We don't get any cash. What am I supposed to do with my afternoon? Go back to your barber. <laughs> Dude, feel all the <laughs> There's a really long scene for them to steal his shoes. Like, we could uh, wrap that up. Don't have sticky butts. Don't have whatever the hell else they ask for him. Give me your shoes and go. This is my first time. I'll get lost. Besides, it's full moon outside. The weirdos are out. <laughs> it's my kind of night. <laughs> Fuck you. Those fucking kids need a talking to. Here. Hey, gal. Come on, Daniel, let's go. In Hollywood, the shoes fit great. <laughs> Shut up, Bob. You're supposed to not talk anyway. So collect your candy and get out of my life. I want to go home now. Danny, I'm sorry. Are you crying, Danny? I don't see any tears. Something just flew across the moon. The cow. We just learned about those sisters in school. I know all about them. My mom used to run the museum. There's a museum about it? Yeah, but they shut it down because a lot of spooky things happen there. Why don't we go to this old Sanderson house? No, that should not be your first idea. Max, I'm not going up there. My friends at school told me all about that place. It's weird. She's right. Just, just do this one thing for me and I'll do anything you say. Next year we go trick-or-treating as Wendy and Peter Pan. <laughs> Why would that be the one thing? To humiliate him, I guess? But like, I don't know. I'd have been like, give me all your fucking money or something. There was a missed opportunity there. <laughs> Found a lighter. Wow. The book is bound in human skin and contains the recipes for her most powerful and evil spells. You know, something we don't talk about often enough is that, like, witches really are cannibals. Legend says that on a full moon it will raise the spirits of the dead when lit by a virgin on Halloween night. Hmm, where can we find one of those? Max, no! Oh, Max. Uh -oh.
flubbers trying to get through. <laughs> what happened? Why would they know? Lit the candle. Oh, she did know. <laughs> <laughs> We're home. It's a little girl. <laughs> Seven. Maybe eight. And a half. Oh, let's play with her. I don't know what her motives are. Children. <laughs> I thought that would never come, sisters. Greetings, little one. She's a smart little girl. Hey! Look on my little sister. Roast him, Woody. No, let me let me play with him. This witch needs to be jailed. makes fire in his hand. He got that lighter from here. Nice going, Max. You can talk. Yeah, no kidding. Now, get the spell book. Come on, move it! Go, Max. It is but water! Why'd they have, like, indoor plumbing in that old house? And lighters. Did someone live there? There's missing elements here. Plot holes in this witch movie. It's hollowed ground. Witches can't set foot here. He talks. They all just accept that. Be like, hmm, like, are you Sabrina's cat or like what? Man, this is the worst night of the year. Give me a hand. <laughs> oh, it was a museum. <laughs> That's why it has plumbing and stuff. Okay, fine. Plot hole filled. Oh, I shouldn't do that. <laughs> so for three centuries, I guarded the house on All Hallows Night when I knew some airhead virgin might light that candle. <laughs> nice going, airhead. We're talking about three ancient hags versus the 20th century. How bad can it be? That's a good point. We've got some good technology. We can figure this out. I believe in you guys. <laughs> it's just a bunch of hocus pocus. I want to fly on a broom. Afraid not. Thackeray, big stout lady feline. Still alive. And we- oh. ah. I dropped my Reese cup. <sighs> Catch those children. Get up. <sighs> Yeah, I'd be pissed too. Like, you woke me up for this? To chase some kids? <laughs> Do your own dirty work. You have a fucking broom. Fly! <laughs> yes! <laughs> That's traumatic. Since this promises to be a most dire and stressful evening, I suggest we form a calming circle. I Oh, sister, <laughs> thou art not being honest with thyself, are we? Huh? Huh? Come on. No. <laughs> I feel better, too. You lit the black flame candle. Yeah. And he's a virgin. Does she know what that means? Why is this such a huge point of the story? This is a kid's movie, right? Is this a Disney movie? Chill on the virgin stuff. No, they're not gonna chill on the virgin really? stuff. Look, I'll get a tattoo to my forehead, okay? Yeah, like leave him alone. He's in high school, it's fine. It's fine no matter how old you are. Just so we're clear. Come here. What? This can't hear Binks, right? He can talk. My brother's a virgin, he lit the black flame candle. The witches are back from the dead and they're after us. We need help. How much candy have you had, honey? Mom, I haven't <laughs> OD'd. I haven't even had a piece. OD'd? <laughs> Honestly, though, if like three kids and two of them are like old, like 15, 16, maybe we're telling you the same thing. I think I don't know what I do. Actually, I'm not going to judge these parents on this one. Keep going. I ain't lying. No, no, <laughs> don't oh, listen to them. Been 300 years, right down to the day. Now the witch is back and there's hell to pay. When did she write this song? Like while she was dead? Can you write songs while you're dead? What is this place? Mm, it reeks of children. It is a prison for children. True. Welcome. I'm your host, Boris Karloff Jr. <laughs> I think Max has like some issues. He's really getting into this. He's born for this 
torturous stuff. <laughs> Evil. They just fucking burned him up and they're like, whoa, let's celebrate. You just committed a murder. Three triple murders. And you're celebrating. Mom? Dad? We got a new cat! <laughs> Mom? Dad? We committed a triple homicide, but we also got a pet. I'm trying to figure out what room this is that would be in a school. Oh man, how come it's always the ugly chicks that stay out late? Eat them. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> He's like, hey, I'm kind of really uncomfy. <laughs> Do you think you could move and like, I don't know, make room for me? The book. The witch has used it to put the spell on him. Maybe there's a way in here to take it off. Hey, someone's got some brains here. That's so smart. Mm. Nothing weird so far. Nothing weird so far. Just like a glowing book. This is the end. No. I feel it. Okay. We are doomed. I feel the icy breath of death upon my neck. Me when I run out of Reese cups. <laughs> I want one so bad. She kind of got chipped. <laughs> or actually, maybe not. Maybe that's the strongest one. It's like a rocket. Max, the book is gone. Telling you something's weird. Oh well, yeah. Did y'all really think it was just that easy? Come, sisters. The candle's magic is almost spent. Dawn approaches. What if you just spray them with salt? That's what I would do, right? You try it. Hey! Hey, you guys! Don't listen to her! Hey, I'm scary. Children like just walking in the dark. <laughs> There's something real eerie about that. The black flame candle only brought them back for this one Halloween night. And unless they can steal the lives of children, when the sun comes up, they're dust. At least someone's paying attention. Good thing we've got her here. They're like gonna frame him as like the hero of the story and everything, but like, you gotta give her credit. Give her the credit. Spitting truths over here, little gal. Kill him if you must! Just bring me that child, that daddy! And put some wiggle in it, you putrid, pestering saw! Don't double come along now! Come along now! Kill it! Uh. Wench! <laughs> you buck tooth pop right firefly from the hell! Centuries to say that. Yeah, you can tell that's been held in for a long time. It's kind of a good thing they got like a little nap in before all this, huh? But shouldn't it be a lot brighter outside? Like when they woke up like an hour ago, it was 5 a.m. <laughs> decapitated as often as I could. This has already happened and it was just as traumatic the first time. I've also already done this. Actually had the girl taken away by the witches. They're just kind of reusing their climaxes. Ah, she dies! 
Max! No! Why did he do that? Now you have no choice! I guess. It's so very risky. <laughs> 90s weren't the best for like effects. Like this could have been a pretty sick fighting scene. Like a witch versus the brother, but I'm not that interested. <laughs> Fossa is coming. So really all they had to do is like get to the morning without the witches like eating kids and stuff. I mean, I guess that's pretty hard. Max? Are you okay? Yeah, I think so. Parents are still dancing, aren't they? They're gonna be sore. They're gonna need some sleep and some carbs. <laughs> Thanks. You'd have to visit that grave after, right? Like, you'd have to, like, leave him some flowers and stuff. He's very helpful. He's gone. He's gone, Danny. But he can't die, remember? She's right. Thanks? Is that you? Yeah. Hey, Max. Thanks for lighting the candle. Virgin. <laughs> Sorry, Emily. I had to wait 300 years for a virgin to light a candle. <laughs> he took it. He got it. He got the virgin joke in. When did she get unwitched? Didn't she have, like, lipstick on and everything? She just, before she went to sleep, take a minute for, like, face routine? Okay. Hocus Pocus. A true classic. Have I even seen that movie before? I'm questioning my life. There were scenes that happened that I didn't even remember, and I do not remember it being so predatory, <laughs> especially for a kid's movie. Anyway, thanks for Halloweening with me today. Come back, because I promised at the beginning of the video that I'm going to do a video a week for October. It's going to happen. It is. <laughs> also, if you like my um, little Wicked sweater, it's actually from my own little Etsy shop that I just started, so I will link that down below. You can get this in different colors, other Halloween sweaters and stuff, you know, go check it out. And uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. Don't forget to vote for what scary movie you want me to watch. <laughs> yeah, that's about it. Happy Halloween and uh, get out of here.